Zurück. Alright guys, so it is currently 7 a.m. and we are heading to Kananaskis. Anne and I, we decided to treat ourselves at the Nordic Spa. So they're very well known for their hydrotherapy. Quite excited to have a relaxing morning. So let's head there right now. Let's go. Gonna get two hash browns and one medium vanilla iced coffee. Thank you. Thank you so much. All right, so one hour drive later, we finally made it here at Nordic Spa. We've been here before, but that was like, what, four or five years ago? Yeah, I actually surprised Jan for Valentine's Day. Told him to keep driving, and then we ended up at the Nordic Spa, and we loved our experience. Honestly, the Nordic Spa has probably got to be my best spa experience in my entire life. Yeah, it's amazing, and we can't wait to show you guys. Babe, are you excited? Excited. Welcome, disconnect to reconnect. Nordic Spa. Alright, so we're here now. Uh, we got our own lockers. Got a robe. Then we got slippers. And then some salt for the sauna, I believe. Alright, let's change and then we'll head to the spa. Alright, so usually you can't bring your phone or your camera in here. But since we have a media pass, we can showcase it to you guys. Uh, they don't open till 9 a.m. But it's currently 8 a.m. So we have a full hour to show you the place. All right, so we're inside uh, the Nordic Spa now. Check this out, guys. Wow. And look at the view. Look at that mountain over there. So they have like a heated pool. Oh, it's gonna be so good because it's so cold right now. Uh, the outside temperature is negative five Celsius. So this is gonna be heaven right here. All right, so this is what you should follow, the hydrotherapy cycle. So first you go to a hot and then cold, rest, and then repeat. So you can do this as long as you want. So this one right here is the cold plunge. It is 5 degrees Celsius. This water is super, super cold. As you can see, this spa is massive. Oh, that's hot. Oh, that feels amazing. Oh my gosh, that feels so good. I know. Especially because we're in the mountains. I think this adds to the experience for sure. Yeah. Being surrounded by the mountains. Look at that. There's a snow capped mountain right there and it's clearly snowing. Yeah. So I, you know how it, I told you guys earlier, it's a cycle. So hot, warm, cold, rest and repeat. Mm -hmm. I don't know if I can go to the cold. <laughs> I, don't know. I showed them the, the cold plunge yeah. over there, the cold pool. I'll try it. But I remember last time because we were here last time or a few years ago. I could not bear that. It was so cold. It was cold. so cold. Like I felt like I was getting frostbite yeah. on my toes. But apparently it's good for you though. Yeah. Like yeah. Maybe next year we'll make it a goal to practice that. Yeah, do more cold plunge. Because plunge. everyone's been doing it and apparently it has amazing benefits. So. Yeah. All right, so we're back in the locker rooms right now. Um, there's actually people here now. So we're gonna put the camera away and we're gonna go relax as well. And we'll see you guys in a little bit. All right, so we just finished with Nordic Spa. Dude, that was amazing. My skin is literally thanking me. I know, my skin feels so soft. Oh, that was super relaxing. Mm -hmm. So if you guys are ever in the town of Banff, make sure to hit up Nordic Spa. It's only about 45 to 50 minutes away from the town of Banff, yeah. so. 
definitely definitely recommend it we feel so relaxed so zen right now yeah just in case you guys didn't know about the nordic spot it's one of the top things to do around the area yeah it's really nice and the drive from so banff scenic. is so scenic yeah. like that kind of nice country super super nice anyway it's time to head back to our home on wheels baby <laughs> let's go we're probably gonna go cook because we're kind of hungry yeah yeah let's go cook and then we'll explore some more Alright, so it is now 1 p.m. and we're currently here at Vermilion Lake, literally five minutes away from the town of Banff. This is where we're gonna cook and eat. We're setting up the table. Alright, so for lunch we're having Italian sausage. Asparagus, mushrooms, and some rice and vermicelli. So we got lunch cooking, but look at our spot though. And here's the van ants inside just cleaning up. They even have this little dock over here. It is stunning out here, man. I love this lake so much. Anne and I, we always come back here every time we're in Banff. And it's just so relaxing out here, super quiet. And cleaning the van. Hi, babe. Food's almost cooked. This is like and a nice go-to camping meal. So it's just instant rice, and then we put vegetables such as asparagus mushroom. Then once the rice is cooking, and once I fried the sausage like halfway, I put the sausages with the rice. So yeah, and it's really tasty. This is for you. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Gordon Ramsay. Yeah, Michelin star meal, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Supposed to be soupy? No, I put too much water. <laughs> but you know, it is cold outside, so. Okay, I'm down for some soup. Yeah, you know. So, we've been getting a lot of questions about our 2024 travel plans, and we're excited to announce that our first destination for the upcoming new year is Japan. We've seen how much you all enjoyed our previous Japan series, and we can't get enough of that incredible country. Japan is a culturally rich and traditional country. And during our first visit, if we're honest, we face a challenging language barrier. And that's where our incredible partner, Rosetta Stone, comes into play. We've teamed up with Rosetta Stone to ensure that our upcoming trip to Japan goes smoothly. We've learned from our initial experience that understanding the language and culture is crucial for a deeper connection with this amazing country. Rosetta Stone offers the convenience of learning at any time from anywhere with lessons as short as 10 minutes. Plus, its engaging language learning approach provides access to a variety of languages including French, German, Korean, and even Filipino, making it feel like having a personal language tutor at our fingertips. Our favorite part is the voice recognition tool. This tool is like a personal pronunciation coach. It gives instant feedback on how we say words, helping us sound more like fluent speakers. Konnichiwa. Konnichiwa. Onna no ko. Otoko no ko. Otoko no ko. What? <laughs> Unlock an exclusive offer by clicking the link in the description. A lifetime subscription to the app for just $149, saving you over 60% off. And with the holidays just around the corner, think about sharing the gift of Rosetta Stone. If you decide to give it a go, let us know your experience. Now let's get back to the vlog. Let's go. All right, it's 
So lunch is ready. All right, cheers. Wait, cheers oh, me too. Cheers. Yeah. Look at that. Oh, such a hearty meal. Mmm. It's hot. That's really good. Yeah. Mm. Ant's like so excited right now. Look how thick the snow is. Babe, look how thick it is like cotton candy. Look at that. I know. You see? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Put my shoe on. Let's go out there. Pretty crazy. Oh my gosh. Alright, so next stop is Lake Louise. Uh, it's about an hour drive away from the town of Banff. But look at the snowstorm right now. It's pretty insane. One hour and 20 minutes later, we're finally here at Emerald Lake. Oh, super excited to be here because Anne's never been here before. Yeah. I've been here once, but that was like five years ago. I've seen photos all over Instagram. I've always wanted to visit and seeing it in person, the photos just don't do it justice. Yeah. It's actually insane. I can see why they call it Emerald Lake. I'm pretty sure when the sun hits, it's this emerald green color. Yeah. Because even when the sun isn't shining, you can still see a hint of emerald in the water. Yeah, and also the drive here from Banff was absolutely ridiculous yeah, like it was insane. so beautiful yeah i think like every time we're like whoa yeah. wow and we've been to bound so many times yeah but the drive here to emerald lake is a bit further it's one of the further lakes mm -hmm. but definitely worth the drive because of how scenic it was of emerald it's so beautiful yeah you can t even in the in camera you can see a little bit of, yeah. of emerald green. and then look at like the trees and then the fog it looks so magical look there's also like a photo shoot they're doing like a wedding photo shoot like down it there it looks so good it looks like a painting uh, i've never been here before but i think this has got to be my favorite lake now really <laughs> yeah all right so we're trying to find a place to get a nice picture Oh, that's slippery. Oh. <laughs> I got that too. <laughs> Bro, oh my you God. have Nikes on. Mine are like replica of Uggs from Costco and I have better grip. Holy crap. This is insane. Go there, babe. Go I've there. I've never been here. Oh, yeah? Look. Guys, look at this. Anne's like so amazed, she's never been here. This looks like a fairy tale. So sometimes a lot of people don't go here because they just go to like Lake Louise or the other lake that we've been going to. But definitely, definitely recommend going to this spot. It's worth the drive. This is my new favorite lake. <laughs> yeah, insane. <laughs> yeah. I think it's more beautiful than Lake Louise. Mm -hmm. yeah. I mean, maybe because we've seen Lake Louise so many times, but this is only 35 minutes away from Lake Louise.
so we are now back at our campsite. About to start the fire. It is now 7.30 p.m. so start the fire and we're gonna cook dinner. fire going. Now we just gotta make it bigger so we can cook some pork kebabs. Kebabs, and that's gonna be dinner. Something quick and easy. All right, guys. So we're just enjoying our dinner. It's been such a fun day, long day. I guess this is where we end the vlog. If you guys do like this type of videos, comment down below, and who knows, maybe we'll do more of them. Maybe we'll buy a camper van. <laughs> <laughs> As always, guys, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And follow us on social media for daily updates. Yeah, and we'll see you in the next one. Peace! Peace.